What are the sort of red flags or telltale signs of, of a copywriter who maybe is at the start of their journey um, versus someone like yourself who would be at the other end of this sort of experience spectrum? When I was a junior and thought I was good, I mean, I was, because I wouldn't have got to where I am now. But, you know, you look back and you see the old stuff and you're like, wow, I wrote that. Um, but as a junior, you're excited and you want to get romantic. And, you know, I worked in beauty for eight years, uh, starting as a junior copywriter. So there was lots of opportunity to get romantic. But, you know, you don't have to say everything all at once. Sometimes the the key outtake is in what what you don't say like let the reader breathe and let the reader you know work some things out for themselves don't make them work hard but you know give them a bit of uh, credit for having their own intelligence um and then there are just words that you can't help putting in you know that is a word you can always take out you know i'm writing to tell you that it's hot today you can just say i'm writing to tell you it's hot today but then i've just tripped myself up because if you're writing something to someone you don't need to say i'm writing to tell you because that it's evident in the fact that they are reading a piece of your writing um so yeah i guess it's knowing what to take out um and when to stop okay and And not using jargon and maybe like uh i mean i'm just learning here but active and passive voice you know we we come across this a lot in the website world so overuse of one or the other is that another sign or yes thank you um junior copywriters love the passive voice i don't think they know that they love it i think that it's an easy default because i think in their head when they're learning they're thinking what shouldn't i say and then they say the thing that they shouldn't um, which is very hard to follow through when you're writing a billboard campaign, for example, because you don't have long to get someone's attention. So tell them what they want to know, not what they don't want to know.